Johnny. How we doing, Connecticut? Yeah. Give it up for Capo, Frankie, and uh, the early morning mob, and the cell for letting us do this here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys having a good time? Yeah. yeah. If you're having a good time, give me a hell yeah. yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Now, as you can tell, I'm pretty fucking raspy, right? Yeah. yeah. My voice sounds like if Randy Macho Man Savage and that bitch with the raspy voice had a baby. <laughs> <laughs> and then they made that baby smoke two packs of cigarettes a day for 40 years. That's my voice. And they call that baby Johnny Ryan. Usually a stool here for that shit. Just saying. <laughs> <laughs> nicknames are unique, right? You guys like nicknames? Yeah. Like Muffin Top? <laughs> or Q-Tip? <laughs> oh, my, why? Thank you, good sir. <laughs> Give it up for that guy. Fuck, I gotta start that joke all over again. <laughs> you guys like nicknames, right? <laughs> like Muffin Top? <laughs> or Q-Tip? Or Boo Boo Kitty Fuck? <laughs> Everybody asks me, how'd you get your nickname, Johnny Ron? You guys wanna know? Yeah! My mommy gave it to me. <laughs> her rotten little bastard. <laughs> I had to drop a little bit because uh, it wouldn't fit on the t-shirt. And I couldn't spell where the fuck, so here I am. <laughs> but it's way better than my brother's nickname. You know what my brother's nickname was? Oh, fuck it up! A lot of younger faces in the crowd, right? I'm gonna give you a little trip into the future. Getting older sucks. <laughs> you lose people, everything hurts, everything takes a long time to do. When I was younger, I used to be able to move mountains. I could pot seas. When I was younger, my junk was like a Civil War musket. <laughs> I used to be able to cock and fire whenever I wanted to. <laughs> now, it's like an empty rolled up tube of toothpaste. <laughs> I gotta squeeze it real hot and hope to God something comes out. <laughs> and some of those little fellas ended up on the sticky towel. You know what the sticky towel is, don't you, darling? I like to get creative with my sticky towel. I like to hang it on the towel rack. <laughs> At other people's houses. <laughs> that way when they wash their hands or go to bed at night, they go to bed with a little bit of me on them. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> Surprisingly enough, I got a girlfriend. <laughs> we just celebrated 10 years this past February. <laughs> My wife fucking hates it. <laughs> She's Puerto Rican. The girlfriend, not the wife. <laughs> dating a Puerto Rican's tough. It's like dating a porcupine. <laughs> Yeah, you know you're gonna get fucking stabbed, you're just not sure when. <laughs> and I don't know if you guys know this, but there's a lot of shit you can't say to Puerto Ricans. Like <laughs> what? <laughs> like, why are you waving around that knife? <laughs> or where'd you get those hubcaps? <laughs> or how old's your sister? Uh, Definitely a no-go. I always wanted a midget. A little guy. A little 
Peter Dinklage. <laughs> now, I'm not saying I want to throw him in a backpack and run around town calling him Yoda. <laughs> a little guy that drinks and knows everything. Now I can see you on some of your faces. I'm probably going to get protested, right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. But I'm not going to lie to you, motherfuckers. I can't wait to see a hundred of those old guys at my door. I'm going to call all my friends. <laughs> Guess who shut down the chocolate factory? <laughs> this guy. <laughs> I hired him, midget, once you know. I had to pay him under the table. <laughs> he always looked up to me. I had to let him go, though. He had a short attention span. Yeah, da -na, da -na. <laughs> Fuck you, that's funny. <laughs> had to do a kid's party. Five and six year olds, little orphans. And them little bastards heckled the shit out of me. <laughs> and they were funny as fuck, I couldn't even laugh. <laughs> Until somebody shit their pants. <laughs> Pissed off everybody. Pissed off the teachers. I left without even getting paid. It wasn't until I got home that I figured out who shit their pants. It was little Timmy. No one was around to show him. Fuck you, that's an orphan joke. <laughs> that one's not going in a special. <laughs> you guys are a great crowd. Give yourself some big round of applause. I'm gonna do one more and then I'm gonna get off. The worst crowd I ever did was for the Perkins School for the Deaf and the Blind. Now that was a fucking tough crowd. <laughs> No matter what I said, the deaf kids weren't listening. <laughs> and no matter what I did, the blind kids wouldn't look me in the eye. I had to fucking tickle them. <laughs> did you ever tickle 200 deaf kids? I'll give you the carpal tunnel. <laughs> and it'll get you asked to leave the Perkins School for the Deaf and the Blind. That's my time, Johnny Ryan. Yeah.